four, one, two. So let's just see if it's, if it's correct. This is, so this is nine, 10, 11, 12, one, two. The two is right here. So you, is Deadman correct most of the time, you think? Yeah. Couple things. That's one of them. So top of the bone <laughs> is L four. L four. Yeah. And then you go but, but, L, but Deadman says it's L three. So if you can do it his way, then you'll miss Ming Men. Ming Men. Okay. So we have ten points, and then the eleventh one will be right here. Okay. So we start with um, Tianmen. Now remember Tianmen. We said we we're looking for byway, so we're going over the top of the head. Remember the traditional do twenty. We're looking for the hidden gateway. The hidden gateway has to be back that way. If you, if you don't do the hidden gateway, then you're not. So her byway, if you did school, would be right here. But Tianmen is right here. So we're going to do Tianmen. Once again, we're going to look at the, the apex of the ear, go over the top of the head, and go backwards. So this is Tianmen. Now, uh, Tian Chong is a little bit different from your school books, but we're also, again, looking for the correct opening. So we're going to look for the uh, gallbladder eight. Now remember they say gallbladder eight is one sun from the uh -huh. interior hairline, not one sun from the apex of the ear. So sometimes people think, oh, it's one sun above the ear, and they go too high. But it's really, it's about a half a sun above the ear. And then you're going to go back about a sun, but then you're going to go slightly up. Which is, when you're not sure, you're gonna go like this, go up without a sun, and you're gonna, there's, you've got a slight indentation here. Now some people, it's a little bit higher, okay? But we're looking for the indentation. And this is a celestial hearing point. Uh, what do we have in Chinese medicine? What is, what is uh, Xiaoyang? You know, Xiaoyang is gallbladder and Sanjiao. When we connect this with Tianjin here, what is Sanjiao? That which has no form. Okay, so when we talk about the San Zhao, especially the, in the head, when moving into that which has no form, it's not, we're not talking about just the San Zhao channel, it's the, the, the non-form, so that means we're moving into the more spiritual. When you do the San Zhao that's lower down, like maybe Yang Qi, that's when we're moving into form because we're working with the uh, Wei Chi. Okay, so anyway, the go letter nine, okay. Now, the, the direction of the needle does not matter. In, in esoteric acupuncture, all we're doing, remember the, the acupuncture meridians are on the etheric body, which is about a quarter to half inch above the skin. So we're just trying to get into the gateway. We're not worried about the direction of the chi flow, because the chi flow is only on the etheric. We're trying to move to the buddhic and optic level and higher. So we're not interested at all with the etheric levels. I won't say we're not interested at all. We're going to hit the etheric levels anyway. But we're not interested in manipulating chi on the etheric levels. So again, go letter nine, go letter eight, Okay. So we have three points and we stop. Okay, so connect these two points in your mind. One is connected with this note. Okay, now bring both of these two points simultaneously up to here. Okay? All right, so the next connection can I Okay, now, when they say three sun, you know, we're looking for the, uh, the medial border of the scapula on both sides. So when you look for the medial border, they say it's approximately three sun. Okay, so uh, now remember, some people's <coughs> scapulas are different. One side may be wider than the other. So you can't just say, okay, this is this, this measure over here, because if the, the, sometimes you'll see there's a noticeable difference. One side is in. So you have to go with the anatomical on that. So, uh, <clears throat> the uh, pohu. So we're going to go. This is uh, the three, the three, uh, uh, three sun from the center of the spine. So one on this side again. We're going to look at the medial border, the scapula. Mm 
three. Okay, now connect these two points. Bring one up to here, please. Okay, well, first connect these two together. And then now bring both these simultaneously up to here. Okay, so we have six pathways. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Now simultaneously we're going to bring these two down to here. Seven, eight. Okay, then we're going to do this one, move it up to here. And then move this up to here. Now when you're doing the visualization, you know, they, you can't just say, you have to kind of touch the points. I don't like to do the needle again, so I kind of touch near, I'll either, my, I may go like this with two fingers or one finger. I'll say, bring the energy from here to here. You have to give them as much help as possible, because they're already fading out. They're already kind of getting relaxed. Okay, so once again, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so we're now we're going to do the Hun Men. The Hun Men, we're going to go the, the Hun Men here, so it's three. Again, it's a triangle. Now, Ming Men is sometimes is kind of tender, you know? So I always kind of like to give a little pressure and just say, oh, you might feel something here. Okay, so once again, we're going to do, connect these two points, bring it to here. Oh, so connect these two points first. Okay, then bring, simultaneously bring both of these down to here. Okay, now bring both of these points to this point here so you have a triangle pointing upward. Connect this point, bring it up to here. And then connect this, this Hunmen point to the Bohu point. Okay, so another review again. We got one, two, three, four, Five, six, from here, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Okay. Now we're going to do the uh, tailbone. <clears throat> Okay, so bring this energy from here into your tailbone. <clears throat> Are you ready? I'm going to do it. Okay. Now, <clears throat> bring simultaneously bring the two Hun Men points into this point here. Okay, so this is 18, <clears throat> 19, 20. Now we're going to bring the energy from here, bring it straight up to here, but this doesn't count as a pathway because we made it this going this way, okay? So bring it here up to here. Bring the energy from here up to Shendao. Okay, and then the last point will be Dashwe. And that's it. Okay, once again, we'll do the pathways. <clears throat> do three points first. Tian Man, Tian Chong, Tian Man, Tian Chong, Tian Chong. Stop. Connect these two points. One pathway, two, three. Tohu, Tu Shen Dao. That's four, five, six. And then seven, eight, if you bring the two go butter points down to here. Seven, eight, ninth is here, tenth is here. Then we do the two Hun Men points. Eleven, go to this is twelve thirteens to here. Fourteen fifteens from here to here. Sixteen, seventeen. Go back from here here to the tailbones eighteen. 
And then these two points, 1920, go in the here. Then we bring the energy back up here, but we don't count it. From here to here is 21. Here to here is 22. And then we put the last one in. And remember, this opens up, automatically opens this up. Because it's going to open up the end it's going to do a trigger, it's going to open this up, connect it to this. How long do you leave these needles? About the whole treatment, once I start, it's about 45 minutes. Face down is better first. You know, I, I don't do face up first. Unless someone says, oh, I hurt my back, I'm going to just do face up. Any questions? Yeah, two more tables. I'll take these needles out in a few. Yeah, that, 